Okay, uh, this tutorial is about um, optimizing photographs, optimizing images when you bring them into um, Zara Extreme and you want to uh, reduce the, the file size that you um, actually um, save them at. Okay, how do we go about this? Uh, the first thing is I've got this mock up um, and a quick look at the um, object gallery um, whereas most times you'd import things into the mouse off gallery I've actually just made one called images this time and all my um, all the images all the photographs I'm going to import are going to be uh, into the images folder okay so if we look at the um, bitmap gallery at the moment there's just a default one in there um, go on file import you can't see this of course That's file import or is it um, I'm going to import this ROM 8 for 12 PNG. Open it. And the first thing you'll notice is that it's actually zoomed out. Um, I don't like the uh, new uh, limitation that Zara Extreme has, so I always get them to actually import at the size they are. I'm going to zoom back to 100%. Just recenter this. Uh, I'm going to move that um, to a, up that top left hand corner I'm going to resize that image so it fits closely to that frame I don't have to fit exactly into the frame closely into that frame um, the thing is what you must appreciate is that um, that image is uh, a 35 um, megapixel image it, it's a big image and even though you've resized it, it's still that size. Um, right, I'm going to now file import another picture, import, and again I'm using this original images, so you've always got your original images uh, with you if you, because you're not destroying those or not altering those. Uh, bring that one in. Again, you can see that we've zoomed out to 20% because it's a big image. I'm gonna resize that way down zoom back to 100% center the screen uh, we have it um, okay just move that like that um, let's put that like that um, and we can now see if you go open the gallery again this one's uh, nearly seven and a half megapixels so they're, they're big images so when you go to file and save um, I can't do it here because it takes a while because the images are big um, it it will save big images. The best thing you can do with that is to select both images. You can select all the images on on the uh, on the page and go utilities optimize photo. Again, you can't quite see that, but it says utilities optimize photo. And you've got a choice. You can either have a JPEG or a PNG. Uh, I prefer to do it in PNG, but that's a that's a matter up to you. Um, and optimize. Sarah, so quickly optimize them. If you now open the uh, bitmap gallery, you can see there's two original images in there: the uh, 90, uh, the uh, 35 megapixel one. But it, this one now here, the optimized one, is down to 0.1 of a megapixel, and the um, as is the, um, the the second one okay so if you then go file save and I'll have to hurry because we're getting towards the end of this tutorial uh, and I'll shut that down I go to file open recent and now it's reopened I open the uh, bitmap gallery again you'll notice that the big files have disappeared and we're we're down to these very small small size ones so what it actually does it allows you to um, keep files at a very reasonable rate um, you're not using these very large images that um, modern cameras uh, digital cameras can now import um, so always optimize your images um, it will make it a lot easier if you want help and want to upload them to uh, talk graphics anyway I hope that helped